first of the brother acts. Gerald Wilkins filling in for Orlando Woolridge today. Made it to the semis. So this is Dominique, the reigning champion. <laughs> Take that, little guy. Now you see the difference between Dominique, John, and a player like a Tyler or a Hinson is their power dunkers as well. That was a power move, but the creativity. I mean, he is he's like a piece of artwork in the air. He's something special. Two-handed power hook slam. Little windmill action coming up. <laughs> I was at the kind when you're under the basket playing, John, you say, see you later, Dominique, and clear out. <laughs> a 46 for Dominique Wilkins, so he's trailing the, Spud Webb. The crowd wants Spud Webb, but they also want Dominique. Rick, I think the crowd is confused. They don't know what they want. Some pressure on him. He's got to get creative all the way. <laughs> okay. I think he must have heard you, John. <laughs> I'll tell you, if that's not a 4-9 or a 5-0, I'll be surprised. Again, the flair, the creativity, and the power. He has all of the elements that you would ask, can ask for in a, in a dunker, and, and he really takes pride in what he does. Look at this. Over the head. Double clutch over the head with power and another angle. I mean, how does he know where the basket is? He, does, he can't see it here. Look at his head right <laughs> up. His head was at rib level. Great move. Not only horizontal, but vertical. Oh, he's as unhappy. Well. He's unhappy. 47. I'm surprised. Judges are tough. And our defending champion, Dominique Wilkins, a man who has become such an outstanding all-around player this year, has really blossomed into a superstar. That's his bread and butter. Well, he knew he could get into the finals with a reasonably decent score, and he was taking no chances. He's saving the big stuff for his two dunks in the finals. Here it goes again. Interesting, Gerald Wilkins. Look at that beautiful reverse again. Gerald Wilkins. Uh, man Dominique can't brother. palm it, but he did a one-handed dunk because he was up so high. Back live, Dominique Wilkins missing his first opportunity. Remember, he is allowed a miss. That's the pressure showing itself. Now, that was a 360 move yeah. that was rather impressive heck, also. Heck of a dunk. But, you know, the crowd has to influence the judging. I, I just feel that. And that's a great one. And that's a 50 in, in, in many situations. Well, let's see what the judges come up with. Let's see if they take into the count that he did miss the first oh. time. Oh, they didn't, John. Oh. Well, you hit that one right on the head, John. <laughs> you see, the, the, the judges weren't affected by the lack of crowd response to Dominique. <laughs> Dominique Wilkins. Do or die right here. I don't think so, John. That was impressive, but I don't think that was 50. I, be, I bet a 50. I want a dunk off. I want you a want sudden a dunk. dunk. Off. Sudden I want a sudden dunk, dunk. Sudden dunk. The judges, I'm telling you, the judges had more pressure on that than Dominique, because you know he's going to deliver something. Look at I, him. I think <laughs> Spud's going to win. The judges are dying over there. I don't think that dunk by Dominique was a 50. Let's see what happens as the chant, the crowd chants Spud. It's like the Olympics. <laughs> oh, how hey, people love the underdog. 49, oh. 48, our new slam dunk champion with right. an incredible upset, Spud Webb. You think Dominique? I didn't think this guy had a chance. Shows you how much we know. What a surprise. Boy, that was thrilling. I say, you were my man. I had picked you to, to win it all, but the little guy put a lot of pressure on you. What happened? Well, he did. He, he put on a great show. He had some, some dunks I didn't think he had, and uh, he went after pretty hard. He had some dunks off the rim that, hey, a lot of guys, that 6'7", couldn't win a bad dunk. So he did a great job out there today. I have to ask, when you went up for your last dunk, he came through with two perfect 50s. He put the pressure on. Did you really give a lot of thought to your choice of the last dunk? No, I didn't. I just went out there and did whatever came to mind. I didn't really think about it that much at all. If you had a second chance, would you have changed what you have done and done something a little bit more spectacular, perhaps? Uh, probably done the same thing because, you know, I got a pretty high score in there. But like I said, it wasn't enough. He had two perfect scores. So um, no matter what I did, I, I, ha I had to get a 50 or better. And, hey, he did a great job. Well, you've been a joy to watch these last two years in the competition. We hope to see you in future competitions. And, hey, by the way, Great going with your playing this season. Keep Thank up the good work. You. Thank you. I appreciate it.